And good Friday evening, everyone. Well, winning on the road in college hockey is never an easy thing to do. And Michigan Tech found that out the hard way last weekend at Denver. The Pioneers won both games over the Huskies, and Tech traveled back to Houghton, unable to add any points in the WCHA standings. Things don't get any easier this weekend, with Nebraska-Omaha in town for a pair of games. Good news for Huskies fans, Michigan Tech has averaged five goals a game at home so far this season. The Huskies know that they will have their hands full this weekend against a very good Mavericks team. It's a big series for us uh, this early in the year. Obviously, they're a very good hockey club. Uh, we had two really good games with them last year. Uh, they play an up-tempo uh, skating game and they work extremely hard, well coached. So uh, we're just going to have to be prepared and you know, we're going to have to set the tone and set the tempo here at home. A few areas we need to improve on, obviously, are our special teams. Uh, especially our power play. Uh, we had a number of chances. We had some good good opportunities on the power play, but we didn't finish. Uh, you know, we have to play better in our defensive zone, uh, blocking shots, uh, face-offs, even our coverage, uh, obviously, when uh, shots are taking. Uh, those are some of the areas, you know, we have to get uh, better at. Pretty important weekend in the WCHA standings for us. Uh, after last weekend, we're really trying to bounce back and just leave it all out there this weekend. and should be successful. We need to play better defensively. Uh, we were a little passive uh, last weekend. We are a pretty aggressive team by nature, so we need to get back to that and really just play our game style, and that should work for us. In the Mavericks and Huskies' brief history of playing one another, Michigan Tech has never defeated UNO in Houghton. Tech is 0-3-1 in their four home games against the Mavericks. They'll hope to change that tonight.